What it do, La La Gang? Okay, this ain't even a full reaction, okay? Really a short, but I am not going to show myself, okay? Because I look crazy. Um, but it's crazy, okay? Because this is why I do what I do. I read y'all comments and y'all make me want to respond, okay? And I told y'all, fuck Olivia, okay? I don't mess with her. I don't like her vibes. But I'm reading what y'all are saying and I just have to respond. And then, you know... By me reading this comment, okay, something just dawned on me, okay? And then I'll tell you after I read it. Uh, somebody said, y'all, uh, you are, no, uh, you are going to think I'm a bitch uh, with what I'm about to say. The kids look starving to me, fake smiles for the camera because mommy told them to. Okay, so she's talking about the short that I put up with JJ Kids, and I asked y'all, do y'all see anything wrong here? And was the picture real or fake? I totally agree, doing basically what JJ told them to do. It, it's, it's just that way. I mean, when you take a picture, that is not how it's supposed to be. You know, kids just, y'all know how it go. But when you're trying to make it look good for YouTube, this is what you're going to get. And then you're going to get the people to say, this shit here is not real. Okay, so moving along. Um, <laughs> she said, Lala, did, did you all here live in the hospital with a caption? Pray for us. Then a few hours later, a broken heart. I be damned. Okay. This is the funny part to me. And then she said, well, I guess the fake pre pregnancy storyline had to come to an end. I just pray I'm wrong. Well, this is why we think the way we think. Now, I don't blame you for thinking the way that you think. But being a reactor, this is why I say what I say and I think the way that I think. It's because these starving chicks, starving, okay? Starving for attention, starving for some type of sympathy, starving for whatever they can get. This is what, this is, I would call them bottom feeders too. Especially Olivia, okay? You started something. And I heard and I seen a lot of videos, people saying she looks, she don't look pretty, she look, it look fake, da da da, woo -de woo okay? But as I told y'all in my thing, I said, damn, to me, okay, she don't have a pregnancy glow, she don't look, she don't look puffy, she don't look, she don't look nothing, she look exactly the same. They come up with different scams and different tricks to pull the people in, to throw the people off. To pull the people away. Now, who say she didn't come up with this pregnancy-ish to throw y'all off from her kids about to get um, taken away, okay? Going with their father. Who said she didn't bring this shit up as a fucking distraction? That's just me saying. That's just how I'm saying it. But at the end of the day, you don't have a due date. You don't have nothing. You don't have a baby daddy. You don't have absolutely nothing because shit, you don't have nothing to give. Now, a lot of people saying Zolo Holo. Are you really sure? I mean, really. I mean, it's kind of crazy that out of the blue, she just popped up and she was pregnant. So you tell me, your baby is almost due. You tell me that you and JJ was pregnant at the same fucking damn time. I don't believe it, okay? Now, I do go with you, okay? Say, I pray that I am wrong. But I see it's all for distractions. It's all for distractions. It's all for views. But she know that she can't continue to go along with it. She can't. Because if we don't get... If if we don't see or get no baby at the end, y'all already know what it is. But also, it's hard to sit up here and believe her when she sit here and she lied and she said everything about Gerard. Everything was a fucking lie. Everything was a lie. But we sit here and watch you pull a gun out on him in a prank. Okay? We seen the different shit that you do did. We seen you go to Houston to go mess around with a random random. We seen that. Okay? We seen where you would make up stories of talking to different guys. Just make this shit up out your head when you had a husband right here. We seen where you would start shit on the YouTube streets. So you and Gerard or make him look bad because you rather for him to leave so you can... Hop on something. You get what I'm saying? We seen this shit. We seen where you staged like Gerard was talking to 
uh, yeah, uh, prostitute, yeah, ladies on the street, this and that. You, we seen that. We seen where you downplayed him, talking about he don't take her, his kids, he don't do nothing for him, he ain't doing absolutely nothing. We seen that. But we also seen where when Gerard do get his kids, the kids is always dressed nice, the hair is always kept up. But we seen where you took the scissors and you cut your baby, you scalped your damn baby's head. Because you was in your feelings because shit wasn't working your way. We seen that shit. We seen where some mental ish is really going on with this chick. Okay? I'm just saying. We heard about there was times where you was in a closet and you thought about taking your, yeah, L-I-F-E. <laughs> I'm trying to put it out so you two don't, yeah. So, we know somewhere with this chick, there is some mental issues with her. Okay, I am just saying, and I am just calling it out. And it would not surprise me if she faked this pregnancy shit, just like she knew what was going on with her and Gerard, with these kids, with custody, and in the courts, and she wasn't supposed to take these kids when she knew that he was able to come get his kids for the summer. But instead of just doing what she's supposed to do, she put on a show, she put on a front. And not only did she put on a show and put on the front, she brought that shit to YouTube, <coughs> Then put up a fucking GoFundMe talking about this man stole his kids when he had on black and white. He was supposed to have his kids. So you tell me there is nothing mental wrong with this chick? You don't think she will make this shit up to have everybody believe this ish? And, and her subs will fall for this. It's just like they fell for the fucking GoFundMe where somebody gave her all that money for what? When this man did not steal his kids from her. I am just saying. When evidently what money she did have when she was getting her nails done, why you didn't go try to get you a good-ass lawyer to fight for what you want? You can't do it. But you sit here and play games. Y'all fall for it. I think she may... To me, I think the situation is probably made up. And as you said, yes, it has to come to an end. So the way that I'm going to end it in a lot of these struggling moms okay they have did this baby situation for so long and at the end they will always say they had a miscarriage they will always say something to deaden it and move on to the next you get you get it okay see she ashamed to come on and really talk ish but she can't so the best way to do is okay let me send out different shit let me distract the people from the people talking about my kids getting taken or i'm talking about this let me throw out this to to bring them this way or get the views this way but did y'all ever notice and i had just seen what do i call jasmine y'all i don't call her by her name no more i call her jj and it was funny that Olivia was calling her un unborn baby boy, JJ. Damn, did you just pick that name up somewhere? Or did you hear that name so many times in the YouTube streets and say, oh, baby JJ. Girl, kill the shit, okay? Kill the shits that you are playing with. The next comment has said, if she lied, that's so disgusting. She done lied about everything, girl. She even lied on, on her ex-husband, her baby daddy. She probably talk about divorce, this and that. But I bet you, I bet you, just like Gerard went to court and doing everything for these kids, he going to do it next for his divorce. Because I feel he don't want her no more. But the only thing she got to say, as y'all call her the fucking tuna can, is somebody want what she got. Don't nobody want no stinky ass shit. They just don't. I'm just saying. So when he was coming around, I don't think he... It more like sounds like you. And you think somebody be jealous because you talking about, well, he messed with me. He Nobody give a fuck about you, Olivia, okay? You a whole mama out here still got your ass in, in, in the fucking frame. Get out the way. We don't curl. We all got it. We don't want to see it, especially not that shit. Put it away. Anyway, so I would say... It doesn't even matter about this. All the lies that she have gave was disgusting. All the lies she have gave where Gerard has put his hands on her, where he has did this and did that, where he had pulled a gun. All of it has been disgusting. She ain't doing nothing but just adding fucking to it. Shit, I'm just saying. Um, She said, I never thought she was pregnant to begin with. Also, she lied about the baby having Down syndrome. She sure did. 
Okay, so when you say if she lied about this pregnancy, it is disgusting. No, she already didn't lie about the baby having Down syndrome. And I had to come on here and say something because I sit here and watch Beauty is My Name. And I sit here and watch Tuck cry because she didn't even know her baby's going to have Down syndrome. But what she have to build and prepare herself for, for her baby. Okay, because this is a cruel world out here. Okay. That I'm just saying. Now, here comes Olivia. Let me put my makeup on. Let me put my pretty face on. Now, let me talk about, well, my baby might have... Girl, shut the f up, okay? Nobody is hearing you right now. You coming with all this ish right now because you know Gerard was about to snatch these kids. Yeah, that way. You didn't think so. That's why. So she been disgusted. She never changed, okay? Just like her fucking hygiene. When you got your own man, gotta tell you, go shower, go wash and clean yourself up. Yeah, I'm just saying. That's why I said her and JJ. They too, yeah. Anyways, and then she said, um, she's going to have to show some real proof of she's going to lose, uh, I mean, uh, some real proof or she's going to lose a lot of respect. Uh, <clears throat> they're insensitive to fake a miscarriage. She gonna lose respect where the only respect where 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 I think is probably the reactors. Her son's gonna stand by her regardless of what the fuck she give. When you have proof in black and white that that your ex husband is able to have his kids during whatever. Uh, summer month, okay? And she able to jump on here and tell her son she need a GoFundMe or she putting a GoFundMe up because he still, he has stole her kids. I cannot talk today. He stole her kids from her and she's trying to get them back. If they sat there and they believed that shit, if they sat there and they believed everything else that came out of her mouth, you think they gonna leave now? You think they gonna leave now? They not gonna leave now. They gonna still be there. Okay, and then they'll come over here and jump to the reactors page like we, oh, oh, we wrong. No, y'all fucking sleeping wrong. Y'all need to wake up. These ladies <laughs> is playing tricks around y'all every and each day. They are. Um, the next person said, live full of lies. Since this chick lazy AF, lazy as fuck. That's all she do is feed her fucking face. That's it. She might be pregnant with a whole bunch of food and don't even fucking know it. When it is delivery time and they deliver, what the fuck is y'all delivering? A whole bunch of food. That's all the fuck she eat is a whole bunch of food. That's all. She don't do nothing but eat, okay? And act like she ain't never... Let me shut up. Uh, <laughs> she sit at home all day. Too lazy to work a real, dry, real job and think of fake storylines. Exactly. Just fake storylines. To keep the YouTube chick coming in. <clears throat> she ain't even over there working on a her oil. Okay, come up with a new oil. Okay, you put out that oil. Come up with a new oil. Okay, come out with some new lashes. Do something. Yeah, she can't do it. She's too fucking lazy to do it. Okay, I'm just saying. Can't wash her hair. Can't clean herself up. Can't do nothing but just feed her fucking face. Um... And then she said, coming in, Liv have fake pregnancy for every man she's with. She do. That's why I said they stack up on the test because they only have one goal at the end. They don't have a goal to say, okay, I am going to try to see where this relationship go. I am going to try to see, you know, put it in order the right way. If somebody fucked over you, somebody did you all the way wrong, like you say, that's what I'm going to do the next time. She don't do that. She don't think about two things. Fucking, drinking, having a baby. That's it. I ain't thinking about nothing else, okay? So I make sure I got all my pregnancy tests stacked up because whoever I talk to, whoever I bring to the YouTube streets, I am going to have to come on here. And that's another part of the content to say, I think I'm pregnant. I think I'm... That's why I said these ladies go into the new year every year on the same ish. You cannot take them serious. They are not grown in no type of situation. I am just saying. But I want to know how did her baby, how did she call her baby JJ? <laughs> 
Woo, sound like you be watching this Lala too. Cause see, I call JJ, JJ. And now you calling your baby, JJ. Ooh, wow. I'll be damn, y'all. That's all I want to say, y'all. I just want to say that. Like, she has never changed. She been disgusting, okay? The worst, the worst off, okay? But but come on her and try to downplay. I liked how she get on here and she tried to downplay. Chrissy talking about the different dudes, the kids, this, 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 this. But how can you do that when you're not doing your shit different at all, okay? You talked about Chrissy and not having her son and this and that. But where is your three? You get what I'm saying? You, how can you try to downplay the next when you step in the same fucking way, just Bigger steps, okay? That's it, that's all, yeah. Real quick, real fast, I just want to touch that comment. Like, oh my God, she did not get on here talking about <laughs> she in the hospital and pray for us and now broken heart. Uh-oh, pregnancy over, girl. You did, I see you in that blue dress, girl. Don't wear that blue dress for nothing, girl. You better push that baby out. You better push that food out. You better push that gobble gobble turkey out. I'm just saying, girl. Stop playing with these people on these YouTube streets. Girl. I'm going to tell y'all, if she ain't pregnant and y'all do support and y'all watch her, demolish her, okay? If she play with y'all like that, she's... But let me say one thing. She is very insensitive because, for one, there's a lot of ladies out here that deals with this real shit. For real. Beauty is my name, baby. Down syndrome. You have to deal with that, okay? Also, wanting a baby, okay? Actually carrying a baby. And guess what? So happy. I lost it. A miscarriage. This is some real life shit that you out here playing with, okay? It, yeah, disgusting. But you can't change who she is because this is just what she give. But she, she quick and fast to get on here and say she that boss. I'm telling you. She got it all together and try to damn play everybody else like everybody else is beneath her. Well, shit, yeah, we are beneath you because shit, your, your fucking stomach is in the way. I mean, when you look over, we we down here. I mean, shit, we can't be up there because shit, you got a lot of shit in the way. I'm just saying, yeah, I'll just be being so mean. I don't like Olivia. I just don't. Um, Now, that's what you call, uh, yeah, don't like and this and that. I don't. Because I don't like how she played it. I don't like the colorism shit. I don't like how she she played dry. I don't. And I don't like how she get on her and she try to play the sides. One day she want to be this way. One day she want... I don't like that. I also don't like, let me speak it, how when she had her kids, she didn't want her kids to really know they other side. These kids are not just one side one race they have another that they need to know about and now is a good thing because they get to know about the other side they have a different side different color that they need to see and be around i'm just saying we don't do all the same shit the same way we do stuff different than y'all do on the other side and the other faces and yeah that lady shit upset me Try to keep a kid just one-sided. You can't do that when I got two bloodlines running in me. Two different backgrounds running in me. You can't do that. You got to be fair and let... Anyways, y'all. That's it. That's all. I hope y'all like this reaction video. If y'all like this reaction video, y'all already know what to do. Okay? Throw those thumbs up. Thumb, thumb. And if you have not, I do ask that you do do. Okay? Do 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 subscribe. And I like how y'all be coming over here talking about Olivia in my comments. Y'all know I don't watch Olivia. And then y'all be pulling me in because now I'm reading it. And then once I read it, y'all know what y'all... Y'all know what y'all doing. Y'all be wanting to see what I like on site. And it's just that motherfucking way. Peace.